Hi, my name is Nate with Westside Recreation Boat Rentals. Uh, when you get here for your rental, just come to the Pleasant Harbor Marina side of the lake, go through the entrance, take your first right at the stop sign, and then take your next right again at the fire station. We'll be in the parking lot in one of the first couple rows. With all of our rentals, please do not cruise the shoreline or beach them. It can cause major damage. Thank you for renting one of our speed boats. Let's go over all the equipment that's on it and then how to operate it. Up front here, we have our vest on each side. If you have any kids under 12, they need to have a vest on at all times. In here, there's two dock ropes, as well as a pump for any tube you might rent, as well as a tube rope. This little box, you have a first aid kit, a little air horn, as well as a little whistle. There's also a throw pillow and a flag. If anybody's in the water, just make sure this is visible. Anchor is located underneath this cushion right here. Just be sure when you're uh, tying it off, tie it off to one of these cleats on each corner of the boat. To operate this boat, turn the key. And right here is in neutral, straight up and down. It will only start in neutral. To put it into forward, there's a red trigger here. Going forward, and then you have throttle. Go in reverse, backward, and then you have throttle. Then go back to neutral, and there. This button here is to move the motor up and down. Before you get in the water, just to make sure it's up. Once we put it in the water, we put it all the way down. And at the end of the day, when you put it on the trailer, be sure to put it all the way back up. Stereo, once you turn it on, is up here. It comes on automatically, Bluetooth connection on that. And then accessory button here, turns on your depth gauger on this side. There's also a bilge button that'll pump out any water that gets in. To connect the rope for the tube on this boat, pretty simple, just clip it onto here, and this will go back and forth while you're going. And then on this end, just quick connect onto the tube, through the hole, and over the end, just pull it tight. If you rented the Bayliner DX2050, You'll connect the rope on the back here onto this little tab through the middle and just pull tight there. If you're using a wakeboard or skis, connect the rope up to here. Just go over the top. Only use this for skis and wakeboards. Do not use it for tubing. Use the connection on the back for the tubes. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask when you get here or even call ahead.